Today we're going to talk about how you can tell whether or not a guinea pig is pregnant. G'day guys, I'm AJ and welcome to Guinea Films. I have a pregnant guinea pig at the moment, she's actually due to her babies this week. So I'm going to show her, show you guys just how fat she is and how you can tell how many babies the guinea pig's going to have and all that sort of thing, how to tell when they're pregnant, what the difference between their body shapes are and so on and so forth. So here we go. These are my four guinea pigs. This is Daisy, Squeak, Chocolate Ball and Sarah. And if you haven't watched my channel, now is your time to make a guess about which one's pregnant. I'm going to give you five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, it's Daisy. Now, if we look at, let's say, Squeak here. If I put my hand over her fur like this and then just do this, it's straight. There's no curve, there's like a little curve here because that's where the leg bone is. That's it. And if we look at a guinea pig like Star here, if we do this, still no curves except for the bones on her. And if we look at Chocolate Bullet, if they will let me get to Chocolate Bullet, it's so funny, Chocolate Bullet is just like hiding under Star, which is the youngest. Then, I get Daisy here. Daisy. I go here, it's normal. And then, my hands have to go out like this. So it's like this, and then it's like this. <laughs> so if I put my hand there, you can see just how round that is. Now when a guinea pig first gets pregnant, you can tell by the fact that they drink more water, and also that their tummy feels more packed. So you can feel their tummy and it feels less squishy and feels more like there's something in there, something like solid in there. When with other guinea pigs tummies, sorry, okay you don't like it, right? but like Squeak here, her tummy is squishy, really easy to squish, this is mine me squishing it, but Daisy, it'll feel kind of hard in there and I can feel Babies. There's one here, um, I think there's one there, and there's one over there on that side as well. So I reckon she's gonna have three. So I move her around like this. You can also see that her tummy is a bit fatter than the other game. It's okay, it's easy. But if I do that with Squeak, <coughs> Squeak, her tummy is not as round. I'm kind of just like soft here. Okay, okay, you can turn back over. It's okay. The more, the of course, the longer it takes, the more certain you'll become of the fact that they're pregnant. And with Daisy, it's become crazily obvious. Just like, look at this. <laughs> it's so funny. When, if a guinea pig um, is pregnant like by this stage or like two weeks before they have their babies or three weeks sometimes, it really depends on how many eggs they're going to have, it'll be pretty obvious to you. They'll be pretty big because then they were before, they'll be pretty fat. If they're as young as Daisy was, they would have had a, a bit of a gross birth as well because they need to catch up um, <laughs> and get ready for baby having. And, um, but if it's only one baby, then it can be not obvious at all. It can be like, like, like it could look like Star here. And you could like not tell at all unless you did an x-ray or something. Sometimes, of course, their tummy would still feel packaged. But it's hard for some people to know, especially people who only have one guinea pig who can't compare their tummies. 
and stuff like that. That is my video about how you can tell whether or not your guinea pig is pregnant. And I just love feeling Daisy's tummy and just thinking like, I wonder what these babies could look like because they're due this week. Um, of course, that's just um, an estimate. I'm not exactly sure because I don't know exactly when she got impregnated. Um, and I'm just getting really excited uh, and impatient with Daisy. Go on, Daisy. <laughs> And all the other guinea pigs are squeaking like crazy because they do not know what's going on. Alright, well thank you for watching. Um, I hope you guys like this video. Please like it if you did. And subscribe and watch more videos. If you didn't like it or if there's something you think of that I can improve, just comment it down below and I will make sure that I read those comments. I read every single comment and um, try to reply to the ones that are questions and stuff. Um, thank you for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.